Handcrafted violins, violas, and cellos made locally in Spokane Valley. The owner of Custom Strings took his passion for woodworking and turned it into a business. Derek Dice has the story behind the amazing instruments in our latest edition of Made in the Northwest. Inside Custom Strings on East Trent in the Valley, owner Jay Pryor has been helping local musicians make sweet music for years. And he knows a thing or two about violins, violas, and cellos, having spent 24 years with the Spokane Symphony. I've played professionally since 85. I wouldn't trade it for anything. Pryor went into business after becoming fascinated with instrument repair. How to work on something that was a, a, a working system and, and how, how to change the sound of it, how to, how to repair things that were broken. Custom Strings is now the main repair shop for five school districts and several other schools. I really enjoy the crafting. I like the, the problem solving. Pryor's dream was to open a wood shop with his dad. But they never got the chance as his dad passed away before they could. I thought it was kind of neat if we could, um, if, if after he died, uh, um, that was something that I pursued and pushed forward and, and uh, made happen, That's, which is ultimately what I did. And I'm glad I did. 18 years ago, Pryor began handcrafting his own instruments, which took his woodworking to a whole new level. And I love the, the aspect of it that I can pick up a piece of wood and I can make something functional with it. And 300 years later, someone can pick up the same functioning thing and play on it. Each instrument can take months to complete, but you won't find Pryor working with any manuals or models. He says he's learned a lot from his mistakes over the years and now builds the instruments based simply on experience. You kind of get to know the wood and you, you carve it uh, in such a way that it wants to be carved and to get the sound that you want to carve. He also likes to add unique features to the instruments. I like to carve different kinds of scrolls. I like to experiment. Custom strings, violins, and violas usually sell for between three and $6,000. A few years ago, Pryor donated a matched pair for the Coeur d'Alene Symphony to play during a performance, then auction off. So I'm kind of hoping that they, they go to a good purpose. And Pryor will continue with his purpose of helping musicians make sweet music for years to come. For Maine the Northwest, I'm Derek Dice, 4 News Now.